Hi, welcome to my channel. How are you doing? From whichever part of the world you're watching this video from, I hope you are doing okay. My name is Dr. Lube and I make videos based on health. I give medical advice. I also create a public awareness of some of the diseases that people should be careful about. So in this video, I'll be talking about how a high intake of sugar can actually affect your sex life or your sex drive. So this question was actually asked by one of my subscribers that I should make a video on how intake of sugar or sugary you know, foods or products can actually affect a sex life because it's something he has heard randomly around. So if you are new to the channel, you can support me by subscribing, hit that like button if you enjoyed this video and also turn on the notification bell so that anytime I release a video like this, you'll be the first person to watch it. So let's not even waste too much of our time, let's get right into the video. So yes, I've actually heard of this whole, you know, people people talk about if you are eating too much sugar, you know, if you are eating too much sugar, if you are eating food that contains too much sugar, it's actually going to make you, you know, it's going to affect your sex life in the sense that you might not last longer in bed. So one of my dear subscribers was asking if that's possible and how does that affect the sex drive because it's something that he has heard and probably it must have affected one of two people. So he wanted me to explain what that you know entails or how is it possible so in this particular video i will talk about you know four ways on how you know an intake of sugar high intake of sugar can actually affect your sex life so the first way i'm going to talk about it excessive intake of sugar can also cause fatigue or tiredness have you ever noticed whenever you eat a diet that contains high level of carbohydrate for instance immediately you feel weak and you feel tired and you just feel like sleeping yes it's carbohydrates because of that sugar in the sense that whenever there is high level of sugar in the body, a, a particular hormone produced by an organ in the body known as pancreas produces a hormone usually known as insulin that will help to kind of bring down this sugar level to a normal level so that it does not become too much. So when that happens, it kind of creates you know, in a situation in your body where you feel tired. And if you are feeling tired and fatigued, it will definitely affect your sex you know, life and your sex drive. It might actually not make you feel you know more motivated when it comes to sex so you know excessive sugar level in the body can also cause fatigue and that also affect your sex life the second thing i'm going to talk about is excess sugar in your body is usually converted into fat now whenever there is high level of glucose or a high level of sugar in your body what happens is the insulin which i talked about earlier it will kind of convert you know the, the glucose we channel that glucose into another uh, pathway that will convert the glucose into fat now, it's a particular hormone or a neurotransmitter known as leptin in the body. This leptin kind of tells us when to stop eating. That's when we are filled up. You know, it kind of signals the brain to tell the body that, listen, this food is enough, so don't add more. But because the insulin is in the blood, it will kind of inhibit that particular or kind of suppress the level of that hormone and then it will make you still want to eat more. That food or that glucose or carbohydrate or the sugar, when it's too much, can be converted into fat. And from there, excess fatty acid can also lead to you becoming fat and obese. So obesity it hugely has an effect on your sex life. You know, it kind of makes you you will not be able to last longer in bed and all of that. So that's just one of the complications of eating too much sugar. And then diabetes too could also you know result in which also affects your sex life. But I'm not talking about other complications though. I'm talking about basically your sex life. The number three, you know, means to which sugar can also affect your sex like this you know when the blood sugar level becomes high in your body it kind of affects some of your nerve endings or the autonomic nervous system autonomic nervous system is just a part of your nervous system that controls your body involuntarily this one you don't have control over it as you can notice i'm moving my hands right it's because i have control i can control my hands but i cannot control my heartbeat i cannot control the way digestive enzymes act in my stomach it's the same thing for erection and also ejaculation you might not actually control you know your own ejaculation to some certain degree you might control the muscles you know around the, the, the penis to some extent but not voluntary not entirely by your own control so too much sugar in your body has the ability to kind of you know destroy some of these nerve endings that help to cause erection so if those nerve endings are being destroyed eventually it might lead to erectile dysfunction and which is 
of course, you know, if you have an erectile dysfunction, it's going to definitely affect your sex life. The last one I'm going to talk about is too much sugar in your body lowers your testosterone level. So testosterones are very, very essential hormones, most especially in the male, because they are predominantly in the male and they help a lot, and a lot and a lot. So this reduction in your testosterone level is definitely going to affect your sex life because if there's no testosterone, it will be difficult for your sperm to be produced and a lot more. There will be no motivation, it will cause a lot of fatigue. No motivation. So if there is a reduction in your testosterone level, you know it's going to affect you not just your sex life but your motivation itself. It's going to make you not feel like having sex and definitely it will affect your sex life. So these are basically the four. Another bonus one I'll ask, uh, add to it is too much insulin in the body, like I said before with the earlier one. It kind of also causes cortisol to be released in your body. Now cortisol is another you know neurotransmitter in the body that could, you know, happen to deal with stress. So whenever you have, you know, cortisol level elevated or rise or increase in your body, it's going to make you feel tired and fatigued and definitely affects your, you know, libido, your sex drive. So these are basically the few means through which sugar can also affect your sex life. So if you are the type of person that eats a lot of sugar, most especially as an adult, know that it's not going to affect you, not just other areas of your body, pertaining your sex life this is how it's going to affect you. I'm going to make a video on how you can readjust or how you can cope with that or what you should do in a situation where you've taken a lot of you know sugary stuff over a few time and then you want to make some adjustment and try to see if that will work. I'll make a video on how you can modify your lifestyle that can actually help to improve your sex life. So if you did enjoy the video, you can subscribe to the channel like I said earlier, hit the like button and also check out some of my videos and make sure you, you know, like them if possible. So see you in another video.